talking about what to play if we went to Legacy Tournament, and they were saying that, uh, and this is a judge, guys, judged yeah. a, a long time, and he said that there's a lot of good contenders, but if he were to play something, he would definitely play Death. Death and Taxes is and good again. Yeah. I'm I mean, running Spirit of the Labyrinth in mine, because Dig Through Time got around Spirit. Yeah. Um, it's gone. It's solid gone. Yeah. Well, she. I mean, she's good, too. She, there's a lot oh, yeah. of circumstances where she's good. I like the flavor text. Something to the effect of those who train never forget her lessons. Something like that. I'll take this one. This is how I determine who goes first. All right. And you pick yours. <laughs> yep. Paper beats rock. And then there's the scissors. Oh, hold on a minute. Seven. I'll take that. Oh, that is ridiculous. Yeah. That's pretty good. These I like that. Good. I like that a lot, actually. Thanks, Dave. I appreciate it. That's nifty. That's one of the cooler ways I've seen to determine who's going. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll keep. And I guess we haven't told each other what we're on, so let's not. <laughs> I want to keep this a surprise. Uh, yeah, thing. right. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. I think I'm going to I want to pitch this. All right. Well, you're up to that. I'll show off. I'd actually been running Spirit of the Labyrinth since Treasure Cruise was around, but there's just so much removal that was running around. Spirit can die pretty easily. This is a budget choice, but it kind of works in this deck anyway, so I'm trying it. This is a different version of a deck that I'd already run to uh, some success. I'm gonna have to go down. Ooh, going yeah, to five? That's rough. Well, uh, at least you get the scry on. Are we? Uh, are we not gonna do one free? I mean, yeah, it's, we're it's, casual. It's, it's house not a tournament. This is yeah, not it's house rules. Yeah. It's one free. Okay, yeah. fair enough. Let's make this more interesting for the camera. And yeah, no, I'm good. I'm gonna have to stick with this. All right. This is, is alright. Get your sexy scry on then. What, I, I, I get scry one? Yeah, yeah, because that's the, the new rules since Battle for Zendikar. Oh, uh, okay, see, I, I haven't kept up with what's Fair going enough. on with the new releases. Yeah, so the rule now is that if you mulligan to where you have six or fewer cards, then after you decide to keep, you scry. Yeah, just scry one. Yeah. Alright. And here we go. I'll start off with a swamp and pass the turn. Snow cover swamp. Oh, nice. Um, right. I think in this deck I'll play. Yeah. So most of the time I play lands back. In one case I caught myself playing lands front and just stuck with it. In this case I think lands back is better. Yeah. I'm gonna play a polluted delta. What we play in chips? This is modern. And I'm gonna pass. All right, float. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Smoke. Yeah, right. Yeah. I'll play a pack rat. And let's see. <laughs> snow rat. <laughs> Ain't no rats like snow right. rats. Okay. Pass turn. And this in, re in response to the end of your turn, I'm going to take one. Okay. Drop you down. So, pack rat has started seeing vintage play in a deck called Rat Still. You yep. stick a pack rat, cast land still, and dare them. Just dare them. Do it! Do it, sissy! <laughs> do it! <laughs> yeah. Vintage is a format where some surprising cards oh, can actually there. see some decent play, and I love that. Like, what's the uh, Slash Panther? Is Slash Panther the 4 2 haste artifact creature from New Phyrexia? I think it's Slash Panther, right? It has Phyrexian mana at its cost? Yes. And the thing sees yeah, play in Vintage. I don't think it's, I think it's no. just 4 2 Haste. That's it. But Vintage Maybe. Workshops runs it. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have to go to game two and board for you because I know, it, I know what you're doing. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. Alright, so. Yeah, you're up. Uh, Draw. That was the worst draw I could possibly oh. have. That's all right. Um, okay, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take another two. Mm -hmm. Blood Ah, uh, Grixis. Uh, Love it. And I'm gonna pay two. Two. Is it charm? Draw two. Discard two. Okay. Oh, uh, that is just. 
just sick. Okay, hold on. This is going to kind of give something away, but there's really nothing I can do about it. Oops. So, I'm going to... Oh, is this what I think it is? This is Reanim It. Just, okay. Discard two Emrakul. Yep. <laughs> this is Reanimator. Wait for Goryeo's Vengeance to show up. Actually, it's I'm not Reanimator. Oh my goodness. No, you're not going to be seeing Goryeo's Vengeance. But the Fallout games have got... Okay. You'll figure it out. This is this is a little bit more grindy than that, oh, but okay. it's uh, now, it's it's funny. I, think uh, I, I believe you, and I will eagerly await seeing this. Okay. Right. In before I get wrecked. Last <laughs> turn. You know I love Good game, yeah. I, I agree. Both mm -hmm. The reason I have both of them is because she bought one and she doesn't really play it, so I played it. Right. Because she wanted one for a really long time, so I played it. See, now I would like to play it. It's a really good game. Thinking. Trying to figure out what you're up to. <laughs> and what I can do about it. So. I thought it was going to be like 40 or still almost close to the price when it came out. It's only $20 at Walmart and online. Combat? And I'll play the DLC for it. One. Fetch. I'll go to 19, 17, go to 17, and we are, whoa, wah, 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 wah. Okay, so the dice are going to show the bottom of the screen, I just need to do my job. I'm supposed to be at 17 as well. Um, because I, 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 yeah, I paid one, uh, hold on, oh, I need to, I need to let you try one more time, I accidentally threw, no, wait, that's right, I almost forgot my own trigger. So, yeah, so I do get my, uh, I do get my delta back. Going yeah. to pitch dismember for a rat. Oh, okay. Going to get a rat, huh? So that's two at you? Okay. So. That's no good. I'm that's gonna, no good. I'm going to have to board for you next turn. My board is nothing but stuff for things like this. Because it's I'll pass the turn, yeah. Making creatures out of nothing probably my biggest weakness. So one spell I need to cast. If you can win the game with just one spell, Pack Rat is maybe the one to do it. I'm just going to have to play the bullet, I think. Um, I just play the game. never played Grand Theft Auto. I don't really like playing online, I just like doing it after I beat Meyer. Okay, here we go. And, um, I'm gonna pass my turn. I almost beat the Red Dead Redemption on the Xbox 360, but then, that's when I owned my own Xbox 360. But then the tray got messed up, and, um, got rid of it, and now it feels sweet. That's all, um, most of my game. But, um, I can't. Gemstone cavern? My sister told me she was gonna uh, rats? Uh, probably. No, wait, that's, uh, oh, no, that's not cavern. This one, yeah. What does that one do again? This one's, if I'm going second and it's in my opening hand, it what becomes can't. ley line of land, basically. <laughs> okay, alright. It's a dumb card. Alright, yeah, no, I got it mixed up with cavern of souls. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. not that one. It, I can see, I can see that. I can. I get where you're coming from. Oh yeah, Cavern is, is great. I used to run it in my Slivers deck and people just couldn't stand it. Mm -hmm. On the PS3 they have the thing where you can control, like, turn the vehicle with your remote. Right, yeah, that was, it's kind of cool, but not really the smartest gear. Is one on that thing? God, I couldn't get over. know what you're up to. That makes this tricky. Swing four. Just four. No tricks. Yeah. 
past turn. Yeah. And you play more while I know how to fix them. Yeah, your turn. Okay. Go ahead and get the uh that works too. All you have to do is smear around it once, then skip it out. Alright. And then do it again. But you do oh is it coming in tap? No, because it's coming in at the end of your turn. Yeah, okay. That's in response tapped. to the end of your turn, I'm paying one to sacrifice this. It comes in tapped. You're coming in tapped. Then my turn begins yes. untapped. It's like paying half you were, for your shot. You were doing it that way, so I'm like, wait a minute. Yeah. yeah. No, yeah. Well, I mean, I'm taking my turn. I mean, less. I mean, less. You're good. You're good. Life is good. Life is good. My opponents get to shuffle my deck away. Like <laughs> if you haven't noticed. Nothing wrong with that. How did you do that? I was like, I have no idea. Like, if I look up something online, so, yep, that's you're good. Turn. Just one card in this graveyard now. This is ridiculous. I keep pulling all my lands. It's not what I want. Sorry, dude. Do you mind if we move the Blood Say Meyer a little bit away from the. Since it's a lands near the lands? Yeah, yeah. alright. Sorry. I used to make duct tape wallets. Um, I used to make like $20 wallets. I used to make like $20 wallets. But I learned how to do that online. I guess. I mean, how do you learn how to do this? Yeah, I really don't have much of an option here. I'm a blood crip. Alright. And I'm a tap. Four. And. I use it. It's a little bit Okay. Right. And um, people were like, there's no way you could, you could copy this like perfectly. Like, I used to make the signs. All you have to do to do the signs was print the logo you wanted and just cut it out. Uh, put the tape yeah. on. Big sheet of duct tape. Just turn them all over. Just cut it out and then just like cut out the logo out of a piece of paper and just print, um, cut it around with the, uh, with the exact line. And that's how I make the designs on the wallets. <laughs> and then, 23. And that's why people want to have some custom logos and stuff. Okay. Yeah, off of like Monster. Um, or just um, a cool And that's turn? Like Since that. you played yeah, that's what, that's what I'm doing. End of turn. I'll discard. For around $20. Dismember for pack rat. <laughs> Get another rat. <laughs> okay. Because it doesn't take me that long. Yep. Before. That's what that does. Untap. But I stopped because, um, I don't know, I might have more arthritis in my hands or something like that. My hands used to Combat? get stiff. Combat? Yes. Alright. And I couldn't move my fingers. And then we'll make another wrap. Dropping Lilion of the Veil. Right. 12 damage. That's game? Yep, that is game. Fine. I'm going to have to board for you. Fair enough. Definitely understood. Alright. <laughs> and... Cut. It's like how Lantern Control, I've known it as Pixie Sticks, I saw that on Gathering Magic, that name. Uh, Top Control, which, you know, yeah, that name. Uh, lantern Control, Ensnaring Lantern, I think is what MTG Degree calls it. Yeah. Uh, that deck just has a bunch of names. Yeah. And I was naive at first, I'm like, Top Control, what's that? Yeah, it, has, it has a mildly saucier name, and people, uh, people, I don't know what I was seeing, I played like the call it Dick Pigs. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So, at least I can see where top control comes from, because you're controlling the top of their deck. Right. I don't quite understand where that one comes from. Uh, dick picks? Because it, it utilizes pick, uh, Pixis of Pandemonium, and if you play it, you're dead. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You got it. So you're going first, I take it? Uh... Yeah, I assume I'm going to go first. This hand. I think that I... This is pretty ridiculous. I keep. I'm going to try it anyway. Let me show off what's going on here. So basically... Hold this up and pray that this works. And this is what we're doing. 
I mean, I've seen better, but I'm keeping it. It helps me on the draw for a hand like this. I, I think I like this pretty And this is the free one? Yeah, this is, yeah, I took one more. Okay. And I will not be scrying because I think I'm all right here. Well, if you're at seven, you don't scry anyway. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I, I'm at seven. Oh, you're not going down to I won't be scrying because I like this hand. So I'm doing it up here because that shows, you see this the screen? That's where the bottom is. Yeah. So that way we like we know where to play. All right, you're first. Oh, sorry. My head's tired. There we go. Get it in frame. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Uh, let's do. Um, insert uh, hard drive or something. Or memory using steam events. Actually, I won't be paying so I'll go ahead and bring that out tab. Okay. And sometimes I I'm gonna go down to 18. The position is <laughs> Let's see what you're up to. Let's see what you're working with. Possibility storm. Okay. Okay. If I may. Yeah. Sorry. Okay. So by curve. Ah, so you have a two lander, and then a bunch of stuff on on the low end of it, and then possibility storm. Okay, so that's like a handful of straight counter or bounce. <laughs> what the mixture? So you transmute it for two. I know that zero is a strong number in this deck because that's your Ornithopter Midnight. Possibility Storm is five, and then two is just a shit ton of counter spells. Like I'm trying to think of what two does for you. Is it, is it charm? It's my board. <laughs> it, it's specifically in there because it's, it's a great hard counter, but it's also a board. Okay. And it allows me to pull something because the board doesn't run like. Uh, well, the, with the way I have my board... Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Oh, that's alright. With the way I have my board, uh, when I board in, I'm not going to be running Ornithopter, or you won't see Ornithopter or Emrakul this game. Okay. Because you're playing creature heavy, so no I board way. again, and that will help me get something I need later. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. No, that's good. I used to run a deck that uh, ran Muddle the Mixture in the main board, and then had some sideboard stuff you could muddle for. Yeah. Um, yeah, you can pick up now. Sorry. Sorry. That was a uh, mono blue infect deck because muddle the mixture also got me my creatures. Yeah, that's yeah. I know that deck very well. Uh, do. Yeah, there's well actually uh, I know of a deck like it. It's very much like my legacy deck. It's the Blazing Shoals. Yep. Yeah, okay. which is my legacy. Very bad. Deck. Yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah. Yeah. It's it's my my Shoals deck is uh, is very. Your turn, man. My Shoals deck is a very strange version of Shoals, but it is still basically Shoals with some tweaking to be able to facilitate turn one. Okay. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and Blood Crypt. All right. And so we can't muddle, but we have double Echoing Truth up. And pass. One thing I hate about Xbox or the Xbox is that you have to pay the play on one. I don't like, oh, mm. we don't really have the money to pay a couple of the fees. Is this one again? It's just what? It's any card. Any card. Choose any non-line. Non right? Yeah. Uh, when I get my Christmas money, I could probably buy it. Man. I think. I can't like mother. No, I can't, but I can remand. Okay. Ah! <laughs> can you draw a card? And yeah. I don't lose the life. <laughs> Pass turn. Thoughtseize is weirdly written. Instead of as an additional cost pay two, it's you lose two life. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, that's because uh, you can. I think there's some ways to be able to stifle costs and stuff, but you can't. No, not for this. I mean, you can't stifle the cost. The card that makes it where you don't lose life from it, though. Yeah. I may. I'm not aware of one, but there may be something like that. Let's. Go ahead. And man, oh man. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, this is just painful. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to steal the lights again. Okay, 16. Mm -hmm. I, I even saw the. There we go. And I'm going to. Oh boy. Oh boy. Transmute. 
Okay. Can you do reveal it? So that I can see what the cost is? Because you have to transmute for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, because uh, you have to see that it's the yeah. cost. That's it. You know the drill. Yeah, it wouldn't let me join That card would be borderline broken if you didn't have to transmute as a sorcery. Tibbles! <laughs> hey, buddy! Yeah. He actually has a home somewhere. Do you really? <laughs> okay, man. Do you mind if I take my turn now? Uh, go ahead. Alright. Right. Thoughtsies? Hi, Eugene. Uh, we're taking Possibility Storm. Yeah, I figured. That would and be then that, would the be, that would be what? Yeah. Try to stop that. Sorry. It's all right. I'm also stuck on one land, though. So I, I know. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. Oh man. Seriously. Yeah, you can throw the barn down, but you can to with your friend online. Yeah. Bloodstained. Hi. And. I'm not sure if it works, but I think I can use. Go here with it. Ah, no Tibbles. No Tibbles. No Tibbles. Good guy. Alright, I think I have to discard. I do have to discard. So, we're going to draw. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> May cast. Yes, you do not have to cast the thing that is of the same type, and it, and it has to be from your hand. Otherwise, it would cause an infinite loop. Oh yeah. <laughs> Which I kind of wish they had missed that. that <laughs> no way! Automatic game stop, you know. Soren Markov. Have you have any Pass turn. No. Yeah, on one land, he's not such a good card. No. Kick for team killing. Let's see. You, I, I didn't see you any really kill. No, I had one! And yeah, one. Ah, oh, <laughs> Call of Duty, you bastard. Okay, so this game is a little bit different. <laughs> I'm at, stuck on one. At the end of your turn, I'm going to yeah. pay one. I'm going to 15. Mm -hmm. Stifle hand out. Yeah, stifle. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, we were just talking about Rack that. Rakdos stifle over here in modern. Um, I would be... kind of be disturbed if we had that in this game. Oh, this is your weird ass variant. Yeah. He's playing <laughs> Pack Rat, so. Yeah, won this the last the... game after casting one spell. This is the first time I actually oh, get to, to try out my weird board because it's a creature based deck. Mm -hmm. So let's. Oh, uh, Pack Rat. Is Dying Light any good? Huh? Is Dying Light any good? Yeah, it is. It's actually a lot of fun. Crypt. Can I run it? Uh, here in a little bit. Okie doke. Coming in tapped. Mm -hmm. Alright. And... Cut me. Sure. Kerplunk. And... Oh, over there. Sorry. I'm used to doing it away from the camera, so that's why I keep putting it there. Sorry. It's alright. And... Let's see here. So... I'm going to... Is it charm? Try doing which mode? Uh, I'm going to draw two discards. Okay. That's basically the point of this deck. You just go through it and Fair draw enough. and discard. Draw and discard. Um. Yeah. Let's go ahead and. I really can't get rid of that, so let's do that. Hmm. Position. <laughs> Echoing truth. I just do not respect Tibble or Tibble. Uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem. Nobody's ever really respected Tibble. Faster. Man, 
this is just like my deck keeps feeding me lands. It's so weird. Because mm. I actually don't want like the whole point of the thing is to not get so many lands in a row, but I'm doing it. Well, um, I'll take your luck gladly. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, let's go with the pass. Right. Da 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 da. We finally have a second land somewhere in there. Pass. Not like I can do much with it, though. Uh, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Land, 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 uh, land, land, land. Well, with land, the land, way land, it's land, going, land. I'm just gonna have to do the other thing then. I mean, yeah. I mean, why not? If you're gonna get flooded, if we could take back the Eugene drop there. Yeah. No, that's all right. That's fine. You got it. If I misplayed, I misplayed. That's my. That's my problem. It's all good. Um. Ba, 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 ba. Let's go ahead and... It's probably a bad idea, but I'm not seeing anything else I want. So... Let's play Blood Crypt, put that mm -hmm. tapped, and... Two red, Tibble. Hi, Tibble! <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna plus one him. Alright, draw a card, discard at random. <laughs> yep, that's right. That's exactly what I'm doing. I'm thinking. You know. There you go. That'll work. Whatever that one is. You want that one? Yeah, the, the one that's separate. What did we hit? Terminate. Okay. Yep. And pass. Oh, are you serious? I'm serious. <laughs> You're bolting Because he still. starts at two. Yeah. Poor little right. guys within bolt range. Yep. He is. Um, update yet for Xbox? Have you for the update? Thoughts? Oh, okay. I'll take the Echoing Truth then. I don't know. I'm at 16. Okay, great. If you could see my hand right now. Which mode? Draw, draw two, discard two. Mm. Yeah. Oh, like, never mind. Now there are no two. creatures and no other spells on the stack. That's the only mode we can do. Hmm. Yep. That sucks. That wouldn't have happened if I hadn't have laid that land. Sorry. But it's alright. Eh. Because then you could keep the storm around. Now I just need to take my draw and I can't play any more of the two. I can't uh, play any more lands. I just have to do that. That's. I really need that land that allows me to do basically the same thing because I can start tapping my lands and I can do it. Now that it doesn't really do much. Wait a minute. Fetch. Fifteen. Get a swamp. Swamp. Ceramic swamp. Swamp to do do. This arrow's gonna come out before. Puppy power. Oh. Right now, if you're a um, beta tester for the software, you can play online. Thirteen. Lucky number. Mm -hmm. Of course. That's how that works. Actually, this doesn't shut down much. The beta for it started in June, on June 15th. Bloodman? So, all non basic lands. These are mountains, yeah, basically. Non basic lands become mountains. Yep. Yeah. And then. Really only good games Okay. Figure, well, you don't have a card in hand to count it. Pass turn. Right. The problem being, now you have basics, so it doesn't mean quite I do as much. Some basics. Yeah. <laughs> this needed um, to come out way sooner. Never played Mass Effect. I mean, I might as well. Really. Another tip. Give me a temple. Give me a temple. No. I swear to God. No, no, no.
Well, Echoing so truth, blood man. Well, that's a bonus. Okay. Pass, sure. No, it hasn't. I don't think it came out. Okay. Uh, Alright, so that was Kyle. Uh, Kyle's got three points. Pass turn. Okay, in response oh, okay. to pack rat, extra fate. Targeting. Well, I get oh, to. Oh, yeah, you get a look. Yeah, first. choose target card in a graveyard. What card will you choose? Yeah. I don't know. I'm going to have to see what you got in here. Okay. Well, I've seen enough thought seizes and inquisitions. They've already done their job. I reckon that I'll go ahead and I'll remove your lightning bolts. I have two lightning bolts in hand. <laughs> That actually would have been what I played in response, except split second. <laughs> uh, you can look through to see what I'm doing here. Right now, I have boil. Not like it does that much right now. Yep. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Slaughter games. Right. Slaughter games. Yeah. yeah. There's the lightning bolt. Um, and then, if you like to take a take a nice long look at it. I appreciate that you know that's how that works. There's lots of people yeah. are like, well, I'll get them out, and it's like, uh, no, no, I may search. <laughs> Ooh, furry catacombs, bro. Mm -hmm. Ouch. I actually thought you were going to hit the bloodstain miner, to be honest. I was thinking about it, but I, I don't want to get bolted here. In the, yeah. In the band. You were holding two. <laughs> uh, the fact that I was holding two. <laughs> yeah, that, that already did its job for one, so. Let's turn. Uh, oh, I mean, that was end of your turn. Oh, yeah, I see. Yeah, okay. response to you dropping pack rat one in the past. Okay. Uh, yeah. That'll do it. Oh. Oh, yeah. It doesn't do as much good now, but... I feel your pain. Possibility storm. Okay. So now nobody plays what they play. They play other things. <laughs> Sounds good by me. Yeah. I'm sure that you're the dynamic form I've seen in your deck will run a little bit better than some decks will. So. Pass turn? Yeah. Because now I don't have to cast anything. Right. Now you, now you just make rats. Pretty much. <laughs> you know how this works. Yeah, I do. I swing. We'll yeah. drop a boil. Yeah. And I turn it to a rat. We'll take two. Pass turn. So many mountains. <laughs> yes. Um, so little time, Batman. by pitching a gatekeeper of Malakir. Mm -hmm. So you'll take six. Put you a seven. Pass turn. I thought I figured it'd be a little bit like around five. No, they figure it is five and This is ability, this is not casting the spell. Okay. So I'm actually transmuting? Gonna... Yeah. Oh wait, I can't. You yeah. Blood Moon. Blood Moon. Blood Moon did something. You, Blood Moon did do something because I can't pay the double blue. Yeah. But yes, you're right, that it being an ability would not be hit the storm. Is, that is unfortunate. Oh well. Yeah, I'm gonna pass and I know exactly what's coming next. So we'll just go ahead and let me guess. Mountain? Combat? To dirt? You gonna do no, it? No, no, you're no. You're no, no. I'm good. Really? Yeah. So what, that's Because it's still lethal. Six, uh, wait, what? Well, I thought it was six. Yeah. Yeah. No, wait, hold on, wait. Three, three, three. They, they each have power toughne toughness equal to the number of rats, uh, so three so times nine. Okay, so nine. Yeah. yeah. Right. What were you yeah. going to go for? It. Do what you're going to do. Um. Oh, I dare you. I dare you. I was I was just hoping that you decided to cast something instead of swinging. But you're right, it's lethal, so it really doesn't matter. So what I was going, if I were to cast something, Chandra, which 
thanks to Possibility Storm, gets exiled, and then I reveal Liliana of the Dark Realms, and then okay, Chandra but, goes to the bottom. But you right? wouldn't, because in response, you have a mana leak, and you wouldn't have and, enough. And then mana leak would get stormed into... That's right, into, let's see. Let's see. Oh my goodness, what? Echoing. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was hoping Chaos for. Chaos magic. I was, I was hoping for that. I was really yeah, hoping for truth on the pack rat is, is kind of good. <laughs> so, there's a reason why they say attack first. Yeah, right? <laughs> you, did, you did great for, yeah. That was good. Yeah, that was I actually good. thought about just going for yellow magic here and casting first just so we could get that out, but that would have actually I saved you. I really yeah. wanted you to. I was hoping because it was it was just a shot in the dark. I needed a legal target. I couldn't yeah. I couldn't just cast the counter without having a legal target. That's true. So then I'm hoping that you're gonna cast something. Yeah. And that was that but was once a, pack rat hits. Yeah. Yeah, there's really no point. That's that thing. It's a it's a and I mean you did have lethal on board. Why risk it? Mm -hmm. You know. That's why I was hoping the turn before. Gotcha. gotcha. But the turn before you had lethal. I was hoping you had something you'd rather cast than pitch. And then yeah. I was gonna counter, and then we were gonna see what happens. And <laughs> right off the top, you know. That echo too. Yeah. So yeah. I actually cited three boils in against you. Boil does a little bit. Uh, it's a little bit of a number with blood damage. Yeah. But in this case, it would have actually stopped your one base of in, so it shuts you off blaze. So that's something. Yeah. Four blood mans and a mega super moon are actually main board. And you saw wow. pack rat, but you didn't see Gurmog Angler. I did. I, I saw you. Oh. I saw you pass by him in the deck earlier. He's pretty nasty. I played against him before. There you go. And then um, there's one other card I sighted in against you. Good old Bill. Good old Delve indeed. I'm not using the great. I might as well use the great yard for something. Sorry. Yeah. Oh man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, let me see this again. So going into this, I didn't I don't think I knew what the possibility storm. When I saw Emrakul, I thought Slaughter Games is gonna come in naming Emrakul. But lo and behold, yeah. Possibility Storm also makes some sense. But yeah, that's that would be a target, that's for sure. There we go. Joy of all joys, man. And then I cited out Four dismembers. Yeah, yeah. Mono, not a lot of creatures. Mono, yeah, yeah none. No, like none. Your bolts are your really in this mode. Your bolts are your only really effective weapon because mm -hmm. I have no creatures. So, you know, I'm just running walkers. Now, what? How are you? So, it's a variant on Possibility Storm, right? It's, no, it is. It's. It I is mean, it's 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 a little bit different. I'm running muddles and. Uh, I'm running muddles. I run extirpates because, as you see, they did me some good. Uh, yeah. Some people don't, but I just I love it. It's a great card. Um, I mean, this is yeah. This is basically it. I like to call it Thoptical myself. Thoptical. Yes. yes. But but I, I really call it Possibility Storm because in this one, instead of running when I put the board in, instead of running for. Uh, Ornithopter in order to get Emrakul, yeah. you're running for a Muddle the Mixture or Tibble, and Muddle gets Tibble in order to be able to Ugin. And once you Ugin, you just <laughs> minus, you minus X. Tibble was good for something, turning you, into a dragon. That's right, you minus <laughs> X in order to be able to exile all your permanents, yeah. because, you know, obviously a theme creature did that. Yeah. And then from there, I just bolt you. And if X and is you. 5 or greater, you can exile your own possibility storm so that you can do your own things again. Yeah, And they're actually right. what you want them to be. Yeah, doing. exactly. But, uh, yeah, but with tokens, it's fantastic. <laughs> yeah. You just minus nothing. Minus zero. And then, you get Painter's Servant. Out. Yeah, you, you know what Painter's Servant does. Oh right? yeah, he makes it break. He blows up all lands and everything. Yep. Yeah, so he destroys it all. minus zero Armageddon. <laughs> yeah, but uh, and then just plus two, plus two, plus two, yep. and then if something does hit the board, I plus two that, and just it, it's, it takes a while to be able to do it. And the only problem uh -huh. is, is uh, like downfalls and stuff like that. But that's why there's so much counter in this deck because once it sticks, I can just Fair enough. <laughs> make sure that it doesn't hit. All right, we'll see you later, YouTube.